You're watching this on Visitor Network TV. We're getting ready here for the second half. Portions of the second half brought to us by Conroe Electric. Ax screen and window repair. Sushi by Yoshi. Brock Insurance. Condon and Coleman Insurance. Cowboys Meat Market. Fazaro's. Don Allen Auto Center. Downey Flake. Marion Masonry. Fairgrounds Rest Restaurant. Harborfield Oil Company. Nantucket Hawking and Falconry. Humphrey Electric. The Acquiring Mirror. Island Carpets. Island Lumber. Kitty Murtogs. Island Pharmacy. Island Variety, Joe Rapaki CPA, Cam Appliance, Killen Real Estate, Lindsay Incorporated, Ryder Electric, Marine, Madiket Marine, and Hawthorne House. We thank all these fine sponsors. If you want to be a sponsor, get your uh, business advertisement right out here on Channel 99, Visitor Network TV, a business holder and contact information plan for six months, 24 seven, a free 15 second video, $500 value plan for one month, 24 seven. Your ad can be used in the Facebook page or on your website. You become a, an official sponsor of Wheel of Sports TV and your business name read during the games by myself. Give us a call here at 825-8817. Second half underway, Dennis. Nantucket 11-point uh, lead. Irving, a nice shot. And uh, Irving gets a quick two and gets him up to 13. Get, get, that's his eighth point in the game. Sturgis is uh, showing the team a lot of fight and a lot of skill, but the Nantucket has too much height, yeah, too, too much, much speed. size, too much yeah, speed. Powell with the, with the uh, get. And nice, nice pass. He makes that one. That's his fourth point. And Square just throws it away. So the boys are uh, looking to go 3-0. Girls, uh, as we said, won on the road today, so they're two and one. Girls don't come home to the middle of January. Oh, middle of January, yeah. January 16th, so. Yeah. Long road trip for the ladies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a lot of boat, a lot of boat time. <laughs> Get there, Jay! points to Sturgis. First jump ball, Wales are in a, they're in a one, two, one, one, full court press. And right now, one of the big things that's hurt the Sturgis team is the wheel of pressure. When yeah, they've they applied it. They, yeah, they don't have a big answer for that. And, and that has to be a travel. Justin Halford with a miss, and there's a foul. That was a big non-foul there. Official letting him play there. You cannot reach in, Dick, when you're going down the court. They're gonna call that foul every time. Now let's see, let's see. Uh the easiest foul for the referee to call. Yeah, it's, absolutely. It's yeah, they never the missed that. The worst thing they never do. missed that one. Oh. Oh. Over the top pass, but Sturgis gets it back, and they got to call it. The, uh, Palm of the ball. The old back court. Brian Fazaro had the steal, but before the ball got over halfway, the, the Sturgis kid got his hand on it. Yeah. And it's Whaler's ball. Yeah, the coach, is, the coach is checking on it, but that's what happened. Riley Fazaro with the steal didn't push the ball over half court. It was one of the Sturgis guys batting the ball away from Riley. And Ryan. Fazaro, no. And there's a foul. Ooh. Hard foul. Hard foul there, over the back. Island Lumber, one purpose road. Go Wills, rain or shine, Island Lumber is always on time. Remember, you're watching this on Visitor Network TV, Nantucket's Channel 99. Also, check us out on the internet anytime. Go to genotv.com. First miss for Irving on the free throw line. Cesaro with a jump hook. Yeah, nice little move there. He's got 11. 
Nicole Allen for pushing in. Again, it'll be non-shooting, but all of a sudden Nantucket's got the uh, lead back to the high point again. An 18-point lead. They had a they had an early 18-0 run. You know, maybe it was 16. But they're up by 18 now. Good job on the baseline, but they're going to call the foul. Yeah, they're going to say he'll block. Use the body, use the body to block. The third foul won't help it, unofficially, of course. Yeah, we're very unofficial here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, bank shot. Yeah. just make some pay. Nice bank shot there. Portion of today's game brought to us by Matica Marine. Boats, motors, accessories, and storage. Service to quotes, Matica Marine. Check them out on the net. Go to maticamarine.com. Not too many players today you see use the, use the glass the way no, Lamont did. No, no. With Jake Lamont, a nice, nice job of using the glass. Yeah. That's the second time he used it. I like that. He, he must be a mathematical guy, because it's, it's mathematical when you think about it, how the, the ball hits the glass and then angle, angles back to the basket. You gotta do it the right way. Yeah, yeah. But you're right, that's a, a, a dying shot, you know. I'm waiting for the two-handed set to come back. When, no. when's, when's that coming back? Yeah, never. Remember Freddie Scolari talking with the two-handed set? Pizarro with this. Bobby Wanza, he was another one with the two-handed set. Irving. Irving again. He's got five in his third period. 38-17, 428 left. Yeah, he's gonna draw the foul. Irving sort of returns, not quite as hard as when he fouled him, but he uh, he made sure he got a piece of him and wasn't gonna make that. Harbor Fuel Oil Corporation, over 40 years of dependable service. Fuel oil, automatic fuel delivery, diesel fuel, residential fuel. Give him a call, 228-2411. Jake Toby on the line, he's already got 10 points for Sturgis. And this is the first. I assume we're having a JV game after this. Yeah. Usually, usually yeah. the JV All these guys are here for, for some leave. reason. Though. Yeah, well, they, they usually go into the locker room now, but I'm looking, maybe they're going to leave at the end of the third quarter. Okay. Mark makes one. Into Irving, back to Pizarro for three. And we got a foul away from the ball. Thirty-one. I believe that's four on him. Justin Helfit. Halford comes out. Three fifty seven left, thirty eight eighteen, twenty point lead for the Whalers. Yeah, they have their way here. They're gonna go to the bench again and you know Sturgis oh. may may cut it down to some sloppy passing in this game. Now. Yeah. Oh, the guy on the floor, number ten, he gets caught. Oh, Gibbons. Coach thinks that's a joke. I don't. Know. He was Coach. hustling all the way though. Coach didn't think it was a good call either. Do, do coaches ever think they're good calls? <laughs> Come on, let's get real. Hey. Maybe, maybe a coach ought to change his philosophy and, and you know, sort of butter up the officials. Say, hey, that was a great call out there, sir. Oh, another block oh, by Irving. Yeah, That's another block. Five, I think. Ronaldo Powell on the break and... Oh, wow. Trying to, try to set up the dunk there. He's trying to get Irving for the dunk. 
but the yeah. uh, Sturgis kid was in his way, so he had to push him. He had to, he had to do like a Gronk move there. When Gronk wants to catch a pass, he sort of pushes the defender out of the way so he's open. Irving was trying to push the Sturgis defender out of the way so they open for the dunk. It didn't work. Sturgis is almost in the bonus. Yeah, that was, that was, that was NBA three-point land. <laughs> oh, all right, we Gets in the air. <laughs> Going for it again, this time they put they put pressure in his face and he still buries it. We got travel. Congdon and Coleman Insurance specializing in personal and commercial lines of insurance. Auto Home Marine Business established 1931. Congdon and Coleman down at 57 Main Street. Be a, that will be a uh, intentional yeah. foul. They're going to call it intentional. So that gives uh, the shooter two shots. Every, nobody on the free throw line. And then they're going to get the ball out after. Number 23. Uh oh. I, I think they may, they may eject them. No, you don't want to eject them. No. No. Sit him down. I don't, even, I, don't even, I don't even think that was intentional. No, it wasn't. The kid, the kid is trying to make a layup. <laughs> He's arguing his going, case. Oh, yeah. He'll, he'll go over. They'll let him take his two shots for this. I, I don't think it was intentional. No. Definitely not. And give him the two shots. Give him the attack of the ball and forget about it. Let the kid stay in the game. <laughs> and the second. Wow. Pretty good free throw feeling by the Whalers here. Yeah. All right, Whalers ball. All right, you're left to me. And 23 remains they in the game. Me out. That's good. There, was, That's good. there was no real intent. No. I think, I think there's a little bit of acting, too, staying on the floor. A little bit of acting. Does that happen? A flop, or you mean a, a flop dick? That wasn't a train wreck. That wasn't, that, that wasn't exactly a flop, but it was a little bit of acting. Oh, yeah, we, we haven't had a train wreck yet. We haven't yet had a train that. wreck. Jesus. That would make our night if we got one train wreck before we're out of here. And what's the call here? That was out of bounds. one to go here in the uh, third quarter. Nantucket with an 18 point lead. Wow. On the way to the oh, third tick attack foul. But nonetheless, you cannot give up the baseline. Check out the Sea Grill, Nantucket's distinctive seafood restaurant for all season. The freshest seafood prepared your way. Lobster, steak, lamb, pasta at the Sea Grill. Bar menu from 5.30. 45 spots at reservations of takeout. 325-5700. Okay, uh, Sturgis is in the bonus. Gets the roll, so we get another one. Kyle Coolidge at the line. I always love to watch lefties shoot free throws. Yeah. They always have a nice form like that. One of the uh, one of Nantucket's assistant coaches was 
One of the better left-handed free throw shooters. John Maroney. Irving with an easy one. Yeah, Irving, Irving can pretty much do that all day. Yeah. Keep moving around down there and they, they find them. You're gonna say off Sturgis and Nantucket got the uh, steal there. I think they batted it back into him and it went off his leg. Sturgis in a two, three zone. Now Irving's setting up too high now. He should get down low. He'll take the jumper from out there. That's not his best position, no. taking that jumper from out there. You want him down within two feet of the basket. Where it becomes almost automatic when they get him the ball. One eleven left in the uh, third period. Third period's blogging down. The first first two periods. Two by right. Yeah. Uh, well, quick, but this one here is uh, a little bit sloppy and blogging down. Keith Lewis with the ball for the Whalers. Ryan Allen goes underneath. play. There's a three-pointer. 23 finally missed one. He throws it on the drive, throws it away. Island Variety, our source for party supplies, Christmas supplies, located one Freedom Square. Keith Lewis again on the drive. He wanted to make the pass, but he waited too long. Gonna make it a little bit sooner than that. That type of pass he was making there is, is for a big man who can put it up. He, even if he got that ball, he wouldn't have had no shot off of it. They can hold for the final shot here. The shot clock is off. And throw it away. away. So they're talking to have 10 seconds to get off the final shot. And the ball goes off the career. Okay, and they're talking about three seconds, a pass and a catch and a shoot. Let's see who's going to get it. Korea pushing off. Offensive foul. Yeah. And that's bonus. That the bonus? That's a bonus. Let's not, let's not stop these last three seconds. No, I know. I know. Let's not, we want these last three seconds off the clock. Gotcha. All right, we've played three quarters here. It's your Nantucket Wheels, 44, Sturgis, 26.